Come right in, sit right down, grab all your friends and gather around. It's time for AJ, Chris, Eric, and Zach to kick on back. It's time for that one show. Okay, I just started it again. Welcome back to that one show where we're doing this over the Discord today. Talk about the Milky Way, am I right? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Terrible. Yeah. Okay. So now that we're doing it digitally, we can look at pictures. Indeed we can. We can look on the computer. We're all on our computer right now. Which means uh, two phones and one computer. Oh. I think Chris is on a, a laptop. Chris, are you? It's a laptop. Oh. Yeah. Well, I guess I'm the only one on my phone. <laughs> Shit. And if Eric decided to show up, because Eric's not here, by the way, then we would have had, you know, four, three people on computers and one on their phone. All right, let's do a Charlie problem. Okay. So okay, so we've done this already, this. but off camera. So... We're gonna do a few trolley problem questions, and I want to get your what you would do. So here's the trolley problem if you've never heard of it. Indeed. So basically, there's one man on a track, and then there's five people on another track. And when you pull the lever, it switches the tracks. Now, you know you would want to kill, you would want to save the most people. But this problem has been tested in like trials because there's so much pressure that they feel like if they do something that they might they think that they might get in trouble or like they just too much on in time this is a very common question in like that you will learn in like an ethics class yeah which i took um, and i did learn yeah. So, yeah, most people would say they would. <laughs> but I have a few more that, that might get our brains working a little harder now. Oh. So, here in this one, we have... If it decides to send. We... <laughs> <laughs> we you are a trolley operator. Up ahead are five people who fell asleep on the tracks. You can alert right. them and ask them to get out of the way, but... <laughs> Should you wake them up or respect their nap? To respect their nap. They don't now, look, here's they the don't thing. look very asleep in the picture. <laughs> yeah, they kind of look tied up. See, you don't see the Zs, N er, N AJ? Oh, come man. on. <laughs> look, just woke up. Oh, you don't see the Z. The last podcast that didn't, you know, get recorded is that we don't have Chris saying who's Eric on camera. <laughs> who's Eric? <laughs> no, you're saying as a meme now. All right. So, so pull if there is no lever, you're the trolley operator. Now you can you can I'll get just tell them, you can honk the horn and tell them to get out of the way, or you respect their nap. You, if I respect their nap, they're dead. I mean, well, that's the thing. Do you want to violate their nap, or do you want to respect their nap? <laughs> I, I think I'm going to violate their nap. Okay. <laughs> right, save the people. All right. In this next question... <laughs> Ooh, we got more. <laughs> I'm going to save that one for later. Hold on. Okay. <laughs> All right, so in this one... There's. <laughs> we have the quantum trolley problem. Oh. If you do not pull the lever, the train will stay on track C. If you pull the lever, the train will either be in track A or track B. Until you observe the train. For and it is an assent to be in superposition. So basically, what you need to do is you have to observe the track first before you pull the lever. Uh-huh. Until you've seen it done a thousand times. 
What would you do? Would you pull the lever, or would you just let it go? Um, I don't think we'd take a risk with killing. <laughs> but you don't know what track it's going to go on. It might go on track A or track B. Pull the lever, pretty guy. It goes on track B. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. We'll have Sully pull the lever. Oh yeah, then the one person will die. Can we just answer with? Then the trolley will lift off the tracks. Yeah, it'll just derail. <laughs> the trolley will lift off the tracks and nobody will die. All right. <laughs> answer every question with Sully. So, in this question, you could stop the trolley, but then the trolley company would lose a lot of money. Oh. Uh, so, um, <laughs> we're gonna keep it going then. <laughs> yeah. yeah. We need to keep the economy stable. See, this is my this is my uh this is what I like to call the coronavirus trolley problem. <laughs> oh my god, you're not wrong. <laughs> this is exactly the coronavirus. Now you could keep Now you the, the, the big companies would lose a lot of money. You could keep the so that's why we keep them open. Well, but a lot of people will die. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. I like how this one has the Reddit seal of approval at the bottom. It would make it over all those people. I think it would just eventually just stop. Now in this question... <laughs> keep, keep going. <laughs> Pulling the lever does nothing. Oh. The victim did it not is. Tie himself However, to the trolley tracks. Obviously, to you, that the victim did not tie himself to the trolley tracks. Is this a dead meme at this point? <laughs> oh, yeah. Is somebody's suicide a meme? So, we have. This one. More? Bro, the trolley would stop. <laughs> yeah. Here are the trolley. Well, you could run over the estimated 20 people and not. <laughs> you risk running a red light. You would be running the red light eligible for a ticket. <laughs> <laughs> so, would you rather kill people or be Chris? Right. Damn it. I guess I get a red light. I guess you gotta get a red light ticket, you know? Chris didn't get stuck in a red light ticket. Wait, Jake is on the Discord right now. Should we invite <laughs> Jake to the podcast? <laughs> One trolley sized lever or one lever sized trolley? <laughs> what? <laughs> Why is there a br It looks like a toilet plunger. <laughs> See, would you rather fight one lever sized trolley or a hundred <laughs> lever sized trolleys or one trolley sized lever? Uh, how, s how do you defeat the lever? Okay. All right. Now in this one, oh, in this one, yes. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> so this one, you're a trolley, and there's a runaway. There's a runaway person. Would I rather run over one trolley or why? You as the trolley. <laughs> Do you pull the the lever to save the one trolley, or do you save the lever to, to save the five trolleys? Uh, I don't know. I'm gonna need to back up here. Hey, Chris, what do you think? I think I'm a. I think I'm a. What am I again? You're the trolley. You're the now. trolley. <laughs> you... All anatomy aside, the you're the lever trolley. to save five trolleys or the one trolley. I want to save none of them. <laughs> okay. Can we get a third track where all of them are just there? These are getting ridiculous now. So in this question... Okay, there's more. <laughs> you're, you're... <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Thirty-five people died that day. I mean, I probably would too. I'm <laughs> not gonna lie. <laughs> that looks pretty painful. Yeah. 30, Thirty-five people died that day. Because I wanted to continue my genetic code. <laughs> okay. So on this question... Ooh. What? <laughs> So in this question, on one 
Who spelled John Wick wrong? Is Doom coming up? Is John Wick's puppy? Who spelled John Wick wrong? Hold on, wait. I just realized that. <laughs> it's John Wicky. <laughs> You're fucked. Wait, hold on. Someone made a typo on Reddit? You better go destroy this person's existence. <laughs> I think the picture says... No, be wick as an e Anyway. I have a couple more. Now. The chicken... <laughs> the chicken trouble... I can barely you're, see the picture. You gotta, you gotta click on it. I know, but... You're the one in red. If you both do nothing, the trolleys will collide and kill five people. If you pull the lever, only four people will be killed. Also, the trolley stays whole. It stays whole? Oh, shoot does not. His trolley will not only kill the five people, but will also run you over. You, could, you can't communicate with the other person. So the thing is, you. If you want to pull the lever, but the thing is, you don't know what the other guy is gonna do. <laughs> okay. I'm confused. So, All I'm getting out of this is hit you a or trolley operator. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what is it? <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh my. Okay. Uh, I've never had to come up with this ethical dilemma myself. I can't hear what he's saying. Who me? Yeah. I said now in this one. An ethical dilemma. In this one. <laughs> I love this one. <laughs> towards B. We'll switch to A, but it won't do the sick loop. To now, I'm a, I'm a man. I like to save human lives. But a loop-to-loop. -loop. Oh, I like to see the trolley do a sick loop-to-loop. -loop. And then the shoes are looking cool. <laughs> okay. That's Spongebob joke. Oh. All right. Now, I think I'm convincing uh, Jake to join the call. Oh man, I think I'm running out of trolley problems. <laughs> uh, you're running out of trolley problems. <clears throat> oh, hold on, I think I have one more. Actually, there's somebody else See, in the Discord right now. The last one I have, the only one I like, this one is, yeah, you'll understand it. But it's not that funny. But it, I would say you could pull the lever, but that means you would violate your NAP, and the snake specially requested that you do not tread on him. <laughs> Although for taxation, you wouldn't, you shouldn't worry. The passengers already paid. For their tickets, the invisible hand would surely guide the trolley the path that is most beneficial for society. Oh, okay, so this is the America Dilemma of the 1770s. <laughs> yeah. I'm so confused. <clears throat> it's making an America joke. Oh, no. Yeah, I... I was I, I wasn't sure if I wanted to put this one here because it's a, it's a hard to understand for, a, for some people. <laughs> But, sadly... I just know that in the 1700s, this was a problem. That's all I know. <laughs> yeah, there was yes. trolleys treading on people's rights. I have any more trolley problems. Anyway. Wait, where do you have these? Do you just have these on a folder in your phone? Uh, they're just sitting in my camera roll. So, yes. I love... Uh, yeah, that's all my trolley problems. <laughs> Oh, Jake Damn. got off Discord. It was too complex for him to join the call, so... Wasn't he already on the Discord, like... He was just on the Discord, like, five minutes ago, and he just logged off. I was gonna say, just push him to this channel.
He wasn't in any of the channels, though. He was just, like, existing. Mm. Oh. Wow. He just stopped existing. Why? I, I don't know. Why don't you ask him? Because? I got some free copper from him, though. So that was cool. Dude, you get free copies of the copper. Copper is a very good disinfectant. It is? is it? Yeah. 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 Hmm. Alright, so I'll just like lather my in copper. The if they actually if they if hospitals decided to replace all most at risk they could present as but what? But the government won't allow it because it's not aesthetically pleasing. Wait, really? Yeah. It's about the aesthetic of dying. What? Copper is like the the ancient Egyptian. Yeah. It's just. They would take copper shavings and they would just pour it on. They would just like put it on wounds and it would disinfect the wounds. That sounds like uh, what's it called? Plausible. Okay. Found it. What'd you find? Just drink. Oh, just drink this. Um, so, so is this the, <laughs> wait, so are pennies, the, are pennies the cleanest currency? Not anymore, they're um, made of zinc now. Yeah, not anymore, they're made of zinc. Uh -huh. If you find a bunch of old pennies, then yeah. And the thing is, even after the copper is like, um, become like green, it's oxidized, it still has its disinfecting abilities. Hmm. So remember that. Well, no, but I'm just saying copper, copper is a very, if we, if everybody like replaced their door handles with copper, there would be like less that. disease. We should all get the doorknobs from that one episode of Spongebob yeah. where the guy who got turned on turning it. Yes. If anybody remembers that episode, let's see if I can find the picture of that. Let's see. I'm trying to remember what episode it was. So this is the podcast. We're actually doing this episode. Yeah, this is actually uh, happening. Oh, th this week I'm listening to Logic. Oh, you're listening to Logic and I this week. Yes, and what I'll say is he, these first ones are really good, and then all of a sudden it just drops off, and I don't, like, it's weird. Yeah, there we go, I found the picture. Because I'm on uh, Confessions of a Dangerous Mind, and this has got to be the worst, I, this has to be, like, the worst album I think I've ever listened to. Wait, really? Is it that bad? I think, I think Revival has more substance than this fucking album does. Damn. And I haven't even finished it yet. Oh. What's your favorite track on there? Like, it's it's bad. The Homicide, and that's pretty much it, honestly, dude. Like, the rest of that album. Yeah. I'm so sorry to hear that. Yeah, it's bad. Um, oh, and the one thing we didn't talk about on, uh, when that episode is, um, I listened to Outcast. Outcast? Um, Outcast is pretty good. They're a Georgia rapper. Sorry, Mr. Jackson. Oh. Really good? Oh, yeah, they're, they're really good. Yeah, a lot of the modern rappers, like, the more famous ones are all coming out of the South now, which is pretty cool, instead of, like, East and West. <clears throat> yeah, I like, uh, no, yeah, Outkast was pretty good, they had a bunch of good albums. Yeah. Uh, um, what was it? 
Legends to uh, now. Here's a rapper you might have never heard of. He's oh. kind of small. He's kind of small, but I listen to Eminem. He's a little. Oh my god! Again. A little bit. <laughs> yeah, but I I listen. Again. No, I re-listen to his albums one more time. Okay. I do it like once a year, like every six months or something. Okay. Anything? Any new thoughts? Uh, revival still sucks. Well, that's not new. Everybody knows that. Well, say is uh, I changed my opinion on some of the songs with on revival though. I like "Walk on Water." That's yeah. a good song. Yeah. Welcome to the club. And I like the last two tracks, uh, Castle and uh, A Ro A Rose. And that's like pretty much it. The rest of that album is bad. Yeah, the chorus on Framed isn't that good. Uh, Kamikaze. There's a there's stuff on. I like. I'm not a big fan of the Ringer. Yeah, I'm not a, a lot of people don't like that song. Um, I like, um... I liked... Lucky You. What was the other one that I liked? Normal. I like... Stepping Stone was not as good as I remembered it being. Yeah, Stepping Stone is not that great of a song. Being, I don't know. I, we, we talk about Eminem every, like, couple months so <laughs> it's i don't know let's just i'm just gonna just... i'll talk about the uh, what's it called it's not oh. infinite oh, uh Inf thoughts. infinite is one of my favorite albums really yeah oh. definitely one of right, right. okay never mind i was about to text chris that his mic is muted well, just on the... see my expo mark there he is uh I can't, find my, I can't find my green expo marker. Is that a concern right now? What? what? I said, is that really a concern right now, looking for an expo marker? Yeah. <laughs> Alright then. Oh, Jake is back in the Discord. Let's see if he actually knows what he's doing this time. You're Jake is what? Out again. I said, Jake is back in the Discord. Let's yeah, see if he actually back. figures out how to join a call. Can I just add him, even though he's not in anything? It's not. It's, it's not. not. It works. <coughs> Bless you. If not, uh. Yeah. Chris, why don't you tell the story about your ticket? Oh, yeah. Um, so. Oh, I know. Yeah. You're already fighting to do that. Uh, I was driving a quad around. And. The Zach's dad was sitting by the entrance of where we were at with a trailer, like by the guy's driveway. Oh, for context, guys, not this Zach, a different Zach. And sat next to him and went, yo. And he went, yo. And he went, what's the trailer for? And he said, quads. And then the cop said, well. So that's what they were saying, that the minority. Yeah. Told him to come back and don't say I'm here. So he went, okay. So he called us, and we came back. There was a cop. And then the end of it, then we all got tickets. Oh, man. Yeah. Yeah, tickets. Bad ones. yeah it was pretty terrible. That sounds pretty bad. And yeah. What were they for? I, I don't know. I didn't actually get the ticket. He said he was sending it in the mail. You could have just said a random address. So, like, what? That's, uh, like, you could have just said a random address. <sighs> no, he took my well, license. Then, oh, get dumb. Cop. Yeah, he takes your license. That's not how it works. Yeah, but what if it was like a dumb cop? Well, he was not. <laughs> I wish he was. What if it was like Officer Sully or something? He'd be like, I confiscated this earlier. Here you go. Have it. Right, right. 
I don't think Jake knows how Discord works. Oh, God, why? There's one more good one for you. Loading screen tips be like, remember, licking doorknobs is illegal on other planets. I mean, he's got a point. This is me right now, because I have to take a math test right after. What? Licking doorknobs is how you feel? The oh. Is this becoming Ew. a meme now, that little clip of Spongebob saying that? Is licking doorknobs illegal on other planets? I remember him saying that. I always thought it was just weird. Look, if Spongebob were a cartoon during the 50s. Chris is getting a little carried away with the whole sending. Oh, <laughs> God, no. And it still says licking doorknobs is illegal. Is Why is this a thing? That is terrifying. I'm gonna send stuff just right. to get rid of that. <laughs> uh, I don't know what to send. Something that's right. user friendly. Oh, never mind. We're... No, it's still in frame, so I gotta. Sure, we'll send this because this is a good album. Sands prays five times a day and begs for right. mercy right. all the oh. <laughs> Anyways, it's so bad. I listened to over the past month. I listened. Uh, big. I listened to Megadeth, not George Third. Yeah. It took me a while because they have fifteen albums, but they were pretty good. Yeah, Megadeth is pretty good. What is this? How to make your own Krabby Patty? Oh no! Uh oh. Nick, is all you have SpongeBob memes? Who's Nick? I mean, not Nick. Chris. Why'd you call me Nick? We are, we're, we're replacing you again. Okay, uh, anyways, the next artist I plan on listening to is Bad Wolves. Have fun with that one. They're, it's a really brief band. They only have two albums because they're, they're pretty okay. new. Yeah, no, I'm doing like two metal groups in a row. I right, think I'm yeah. going crazy. Uh -huh. And it may even be higher than that. I can hear the music to that picture with the Spongebob cops. Okay, so Jake can talk in the Discord, but he can't actually... Wait, so he's in the Discord, just push him to this... Ch I don't know how to do that. Do I drag him? Where, where do I add him? How do I add him? Invite to server? No, I'm not inviting him to the no-loop zone. If he's in the server, you can pull him to this channel. How do I do that? That is different enough that it's up your antibodies don't recognize can I just, it. Like what? Then you can get it again, but it's technically not the well, So what's this Life of Pi reference that Chris sent? It's just Patrick, dude. Come on. Life of Patrick. Whatever. It's fine. Hey, it's a good movie. Life of Pi, I haven't seen it. I don't have any Spongebob memes to send, but that's okay. Anything else we could talk about? Hmm. You ever just go to the library and... Yes. Exactly. What do... Oh, it's not a Spongebob meme, but what does this have to do with anything? Cheers to the end of the podcast. Oh, we're ending it? Alright, I know how to end it. I'll send something that's very useful, okay? Yeah. Alright. <laughs> uh, hold on. <laughs> okay. There's a, hold on. There's a lot of typos in here. What? Look, is there typos in the B-movie script? Look, it says ooming. There's a... Uh, what else is there? O-N? There's a... Uh, let's see, there's quite a few in here. We should, uh, we should pull the B-movie script and find out. Welcome to New Hive o -itty. The C and the O are not even close to each other. Dead 
Okay, well, uh, let's. How about we just type the things we usually say during the outro? Man captures B, forces it to watch B movie. I'm still waiting on the Bs. Oh, that's terrible. Okay. Zach is typing. The three rice balls. I give this... Two thumbs up. There you go. Well, oh no. <laughs> Chris is also mashing around. Licking toy. Oh, stop. Okay. Alright, boys. I think this is a good place to end it. This is a good place to end it because I have to take a math test. Good luck, Chris, on your math test. All right, see you guys later. She just typed the same thing. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Hold on, I want to do one more thing before I leave. Oh, no, Chris, you're stealing my idea. No, I was going to do that. No, Chris. <laughs>